Hello beautiful people, welcome to my channel. I'm Mandy and I like to talk about makeup and makeup panning. So let's get started with today's update for the Unicorn Project Pan 2.0. The hashtag for this project is hashtag panning unicorn. This is a project that was created by Kana of Kana's Closet. Uh, it is a three-month project that started on February 20th and ends on May 21st. That's next month. Woo! Only, wait. Yeah. Wow. Didn't realize time flies so fast. Anyway, uh, this is a three-month project with monthly updates. It is a project to get use out of your unique and magical products in your collection. You can choose up to five items to uh, that are one-of-a-kind magical items in your project. Set your own goals and get use out of them. I have five products in, two of which I met my goals on, and I'm going to add one more. So let's go over what I have in this project so far. First of all, I had the MAC strobe cream in pink light. It is this little guy here. It was a deluxe sample size and it is a nice highlighting primer ser serum and my goal was to finish it and I have indeed finished it. I didn't cut it open but there is nothing left in there for me to squeeze out. I could cut it open and scrape the sides. I'm not going to. I got this in an Ipsy a while ago and so I used as much as I could I used it five times this month and I used it 16 times total in this project to finish it up so that is finished and done yay next up is my NYX slide on hold on let me read the whole thing if I can all right slide on eye pencil Oh, there it is. Slide on, glide on, stay on, and definitely turn, definitely a, a turn on waterproof extreme shine eyeliner. This eyeliner is so good, the name had to be this long. That's literally what it says. But this is the eyeliner from NYX in the glide on, stay on, waterproof in platinum very shiny. I will swatch this for you. It is gorgeous. I have it on my lower water line today and it is gorgeous. I've used it three times this month for a total of five uses in this project. My goal is to use it ten times so I need to use it five more times in the next month which won't be a problem. It is super creamy and super pigmented and easy to use. I just have other things I've been using on, working on, but I'm definitely going to work on this in the next month to get those last five uses. I hadn't realized there were, I thought there were two more months left. Okay, I need to get cracking. So the next product is my ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in the Ultra Glitter in the shade Plume. And I have it today tapped on the inner half of my eye. And this is what it looks like there. It is a beautiful dusty pink glitter sort of topper shade. Uh, my goal is to use it 10 times and so far I've only used it twice in this project and only once this month. So there is that there. It's got a like pink base with lots of silver, lots of uh, shimmery pinks. Pretty shimmery pinks. Um, yeah, I need to crack into using this more. Because um, I keep forgetting I have it and I don't do anything with pink very often. So I have to remind myself to use that. And I have eight more uses to go this month. So, um, you know, I got my work cut out for me. You might be seeing a lot more pink and, and red looks from me. But, um, yeah, maybe throw it over some silver or blue or purple or something else. I don't know. Maybe I'll throw it on everything. We'll see. I might wear it every day. Who knows? Um, next is the Koki Crystal Fusion Liquid Eyeshadow in Galactic. It is this guy right here. Where's the side that has the color? There you go. 
and my goal is to use this five times. It has a lower goal because I know it's harder for me to use. I've reached for it twice. And last time I decided I'd try wearing it as an eyeliner and it worked pretty good. Let me get a swatch of that there. And then, um, yeah, I think I was wearing it in my last video um, with my blue look, but there it is there. It is a nice shiny metallic blue. I just have to learn how to use it because I, I think last time I used it, it worked pretty good, but I have had problems with it getting too thick and cakey and making my eyelids all wrinkly looking. So, um, that is something I'm practicing using. Like I said, I tried using it as liquid eyeliner and that worked pretty good. And then I tapped it on my lids and that worked well as well. So three more uses to get in that, get use out of that. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, I love the color. It's just, I'm not, I'm not a fan of liquid eyeshadows apparently. Um, so I'm learning, but that's okay. That's what we're here for, to learn what we like and what we don't. Um, finally, my, my last product was my Bite Multi Stick in Peacock Pearl. This is a beautiful product. It's got like a red base with blue and purple shift to it and uh, my goal was to use this five times at the last update I used it four and I have used it one more time it is that there um, I use it as a lipstick topper on top of like a bright pink lick look I will put this over it and make it darker um, I'm not wearing it today um, today I'm wearing a different this red lipstick um, but my goal was met for that. So I met my goal for this and for the MAC strobe cream. So that's two out of five, um, products with goals met. And I figured I would bring in one more product in this last month just to get a little bit of use out of, and it's totally easy for me to use. And it is a beautiful thing that I keep forgetting I have. It is this guy here. This is from L'Oreal. It is the Galactic Lumiere Holographic Lip Gloss in the shade Sapphire Star and this is a really pretty gloss that just goes on and gives a little shine and I'm gonna bring this in for five uses I swatched it in a really bad place and I I always see everybody else swatch there and I'm like oh yeah I can you know it's got a hint of blueness to it but it's mostly just a nice gloss and um, with a little bit of sparkly iridescence in it. There we go. So yeah, one last magic -y item to bring into this project for a five use goal. And then that's it. So next month will be the finale. Wow, that crept up on me. I really didn't think that went that fast. But it is May it is April already, isn't it? So if you are in doing this project, how are you getting on with your products? And yeah, let me know what you think of everything. And I look forward to seeing how much progress I can get. If I can use this eight times, this eight times and this three times in the next month. And this I will have no, the eyeliner I will have no problem using. And I'll have no problem using the lip gloss. It's just these two eye products that I'm really have my work cut out for me. I might be able to do this three times. This eight times, I'm not sure, but we'll give it a try. We'll give it a good old try. I will be putting this on a lot. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my content and keep up with all my projects, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video, which is typically three times a week on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Except for, you know, today and Wednesday, there were two videos. But, you know, that's the midweek thing where everybody decided to make all their projects on the 20th. So, that's okay. This is a little bit late, but, you know, it, it is what it is. Anyway, thank you. Until I end my next video, take care. Bye.